We are live. I don't know if we're live yet. We're going to wait for that little thing to spin. But I think we're live. Hello, everyone. Hey, guys. I think we're live right now. So we're just going to go ahead. Hey, team. I just want to reach out to you guys. Gang. Well, gang, here we are. We're going to act like Hi, we're live everyone. now. Hi, everyone. Technical difficulties. You know, gang, hey, we wanted to reach out to you guys and just tell you we're super proud of everybody going through this covert and the changes that we've had with, you know, you guys being locked in your house, you know, in different countries, whether you're in Canada, the United States or Mexico or Philippines. even Philippines. Hey, Philippines. And, and we know that you guys have all been awesome waiting for things to keep moving and stuff. And we're super proud of you guys for that. But, you know, it, you know, different parts of the, of the United States and parts of Canada and even even the Philippines, the app is active in different parts. Some are active in more areas and some are active in less areas. Uh, but you know what? What we're finding out, Jenny and I have been working directly with Orrin and Lori Woodward. And gosh, I think we just talked. It was Friday. Mm -hmm. Friday we talked with him. It for, was a good talk. It was a good talk. You know, we got a chance to sit and chat with him over Zoom. And we're excited to even hear that it's still growing. You know, you know just in recent days, 25%. Just in people using the app and as high as 51%. In, in other areas, but just 25% here just in the last few days, you know, in the last thanks, you know, 25 to 60 days, I think you, somewhere between there, I'd have to get the numbers again, that the consumer use, it's the app is growing and people retaining and keeping the app. So, you know, what we're excited about is, you know, now, you, you know, what's happening is what we're seeing is because even pizza, you know, yesterday, I, um, uh, I seen a sign that Pizza Hut had posted on, on one of their restaurants that they were going cashless. And, you know, it, it, you know, a lot of these stores are starting to not want to accept cash. And, you know, I went to Burger King a couple times and Kohl's and some places and recently using the app more. And the cashiers and the people at the checkouts have been thanking me for using the app. And I asked them why. I said, why would you thank me for using the app? And they said, Greg, because every time that we somebody uses the, the the credit card machine or every time we open up the cash register, we have to disinfect it every time. And imagine that every customer coming through. So when I go to the cat, even a Burger King guy, you know, guys use the app through drive through. I hear people saying, gosh, it's it's a pain to use it in the drive through. Man, it's not. I mean, I go right through drive through I, and they tell me what it costs. I bring it up. I get to the window. Boom. There it is. And I showed the, you know, the gal at Burger King the last couple times, the app and the drive through, and she was yeah, thankful. Like this one. Yeah. You can't see it, guys. Yeah. It's you, too much. Yeah, light. It's, it's too much light there. But she thanked me in the drive through. She said, "Greg, thank you for, for paying with a gift card." And I said, "Why?" She said, "Because everybody that comes through drive through or in our restaurant that uses a debit card or the cash a register, if they're even accepting cash, we have to disinfect it every time." But with you. We just look at your gift card when we type it in, and because nobody else touched it, I don't have to disinfect it. We just show her phone. We just show her the phone, and she was and sometimes so, they will scan it. Yeah, sometimes scan the code. folks That's just it. just have the code, and you know, and they can scan it. So you know, get out there, use the app. Be super proud of everybody for starting to to use that app more, and also now with the vendor option through the coupons. Go to your local stores in your area. And take your your phone with you. You can go into the you know in the life leadership page under announcements, and you know I can post it there. But there's there's for vendors there's an application you can print or there's a website, and you can go into a store. I've talked to a couple to where we can go and say, listen, Mister Store, during COVID, I know right now your stores were closed, they were downsized. Um, you know your local store here. What if you could market for free and advertise for free? Or would you like that? Who's going to say no? So, so the business owner can can advertise for free mm -hmm. uh, on the coupon section of, of the super app, and they pick the percentage of what they're going to give off. And largely, what we're seeing is now those vendors are becoming customers of the super app because they want to to you know to see the benefits of what their customers are going to see. They don't have to, but who's going to say no if if you go into these stores and you offer them a way to advertise for free and to get customers for free in their local cities? I don't know any business that would right now. And, you know, so, the, you know, a couple things. One, use the app. Use the app. If you participate, you know, I'm getting some questions you from. You become free. Yeah. I'm getting questions from people that, gosh, I'm frustrated about the super if app. I'm frustrated about COVID. You know, does this thing really work for me? Well, it everything works if you participate. It, you know, your car doesn't work unless you turn the key on and put it in drive and go. 
Your heater doesn't work in your house, your furnace, unless you turn it on. The air conditioner doesn't cool unless you turn it on. If you participate, turn it on and go use the app. You're still shopping. You know, if you're shopping online, use the app online. Um, you know, just remember that, you, you know, you, you can, all the stores that are in your app. So the one thing that I want to, you know, the point out is, you know, Jenny and I, as, as we've been working with Orrin and been working through locally on getting teams going and, and making sure they're excited, you know, over in the Philippines, there's an app that works over there now. There is the travel. Don't worry, guys. We'll be going to Philippines. We're going to everything. Yep. After the, you know, we were planning on going to the Philippines and then COVID hit. But over in the Philippines, the app works. There's parts of it that work. The travel package has just got launched. One of the largest travel packages out there, um, you know, you know, in the world that I know. Yes, of. you guys should promote um, that. You know, and and then there's the financial fitness over in the Philippines. Who doesn't want financial fitness in the Philippines? You know, I, I talked to a guy over in Asia that flew over here last. Last year to Battle Creek, a multimillionaire that took life leadership back to Asia just for the financial fitness package. So there's, there's guys, if you participate in the app, it will work. Look for everything that's right about it, and you'll see nothing that's wrong about it. You will. Correct. That's what you need. Well, I need to write that down. Yeah, that, that was th good. That was pretty wise. Wow. So <laughs> you know, if, if you look for everything that's right about it, you'll see nothing that's wrong about it. But I'll flip that around. If you look for everything that's, that, that you think's wrong about it, you'll find nothing right about it and you won't participate. So don't starve yourself. This is an entrepreneur's economic environment. It is time to grow. And those that want to grow right now will come out of this strong in any country. Especially at this time. It is. And, and if you're waiting, if you're in Canada, if you're in the Philippines, if you're in Mexico, if you're in the United States, some of those other countries are limited on what apps they have. Guys, it's just like the, the movie, The Field of Dreams. If you build it, it will grow. You remember the quote? Oh, keep building. It, you, know, the, the, you know, the gentleman in Field of Dreams stood out in an empty cornfield and was hearing voices. And he was told to build a baseball field and people would come. Well, everyone thought he was crazy. He built, he mowed down his own cornfield. He invested money, took from his savings, emptied his retirement, built this huge baseball diamond. And everyone thought he was nuts. But at the end of the movie, he built it and all these people came to play baseball. And it grew and he made millions after that. If you watch the, the second bio of the movie and how they, the, the, you know, they seen it grow. People were lining up to come watch these people walk out of the cornfield and, and play baseball. People are, we're going to take this app to a million people. So Philippines, Mexico, Canada, if you build it, they will come. You know, you know, to be able to get Orrin and Lori to spend more time in these countries, they will. Let's build it and they will come. So don't find a reason why the app's not working. Don't compare our app to other businesses that are short-term growing and giving you money today, but next yeah. week it's gone. This is a long-term business, guys. You know, I've been you know introduced to a couple different things over the course of the year, and some of these businesses are short-term. Some knowing they're going to be short-term. Some we don't know how long they're going to be around. We know that consumer spending will always be around, and gift cards will always be around. So find everything that's right about this participate join us on saturdays saturday night well on well well and there's saturday at noon there's there's calls oh, the bible yeah the, the book study that goes through that's a spiritual study go core four and we'll talk about that but tonight what we're going to do um we're going to have an event tonight and we're going to have one every month all the way through through november we may have some additional ones uh, and the address here locally in kalamazoo is at the Courtyard by Marriott at 400 Trade Center Way in Portage, Michigan. It's behind Steak and Shake there. But if you come up there about 7.15 and, and ask for Jenny or Greg, you can wait. We're going to be having a, um, a meeting ahead of time at 6 for, you know, for some other folks. And if you come up there at 7.15, there'll be some food. We can meet you out on the couches. We'll be all COVID proof and all that stuff. And we can talk to you about how to build your business. If you're not in this business, come. If you want to get to make some extra money, it come. If you can only watch somebody Netflix, Amazon, and Hulu, anyways, so come. Why wouldn't you want to get paid to go shopping, to have fun, make money, and make a difference? You get cash back, man. Cash Every back. time you go shopping, it is. You know, Costco, some, some? Costco, Sam's, Pandora, uh, Nintendo's on there now. JC Penney's. I mean, all these places are on here. So, but again, Kohl's. Kohl's my favorite. You know, again. So. 
Gang, we're super proud of you guys. But again, look for what is good about this and you'll see nothing wrong with this because everybody's doing this. Guys, you know, we're excited for you. The future's great. We're going to be, um, you know, there's a, I know there's a promotion coming up that we'll talk about that you too can get a chance to go spend time with Orrin and Lori Woodward in their house in Michigan here in August. So we'll talk about the promotions for that and how to qualify for that and be able to take you there. So guys, we'll talk to you later. Those that want to come up there to the Kalamazoo location tonight, we'll be there. Uh, we'll be there. And also, there's also a link to a meeting I'm going to post tonight at eight o'clock with Rob Robson is going to be doing an open meeting online tonight. So I'm going to post that link that you guys can can actually see Rob Robson show an, a live meeting because tonight's Tuesday. Every Tuesday we do an open meeting. Mm -hmm. So you can go up to that. And if we get enough people participating that want to come up, maybe we can watch it as a group. Uh, and I know we're going to be sending that link out to some folks who want to watch it, but you want to participate in it. it. You know, it's just like eating a cake. If you, if you participate it and eat it, it's good. If you just look at it, you don't know what it tastes like and you're not sure if it's any good. So participate. Super proud of you guys. And hey, we'll see you tonight. Bye-bye.